What's happening here? What, could you run your hand over that? Yeah. Hold on just a second. What are you getting? Well, I'm getting a bounce, mm -hmm. um, but there's a lightness within it as well. Interesting. Yeah. Well, you know, honey, it's a yeah. very tricky color, and I'll tell you why. Mm -hmm. Terry and uh, I worship an unconventional deity, the power of another dimension. Now, you're not going to read about this dimension in a book or in a magazine or uh, in a newspaper uh, because it doesn't exist anywhere except in my own mind. Through our ceremonies and our rituals, we have witnessed firsthand the awesome and vibratory power of color. We experience it as alive and constantly shaping our experience. And we believe that this saturated energy is the basis of all creation. We are Wink, W-I-N-C, witches in nature's colors. Wink. <laughs> Now, I know the word witch may be a problem for some of you. The word has a lot of silly connotations. Uh, and no, ladies and gentlemen, we do not ride around on broomsticks and wear pointy hat. Well, we don't ride on broomsticks. This is not an occult science. This is not one of those crazy uh, systems of uh, divination and astrology. That stuff's hooey, and you got to have a screw loose to go in for that sort of thing. Mm -hmm. our, our, our beliefs are fairly commonplace and simple to understand. Humankind is simply materialized color operating on the 49th vibration. You would uh, make that conclusion walking down the street or going to the store.